rumored to be in an ill temper. Have a good day, sir. Will do. Bye, Jasper. My prince. Prince. Hello, Prince. My lord. Nasty business, ah, damn the Prince. Industrial. Hello, sir. But it's not my place to speak of your day, Prince. Oh, how are you, my Prince? Welcome, ah, dear welcome friend. Back, friend. My lord. Oh, brave knight. Have you come to protect me? <laughs> you big softy. You'd be rubbish in a fight, wouldn't you? <laughs> wouldn't you? I'll protect you, my lady. Hmm, I don't know. You don't... He'll be there to support you. I don't know what this place would be like without him. I'm sure he'll want to continue with your instruction today. He seems obsessed with combat training lately. You can always... Hmm. Well, I heard all he did was stand up for one of the kids working in the factory. Welcome, your majesty. Such an honor to have you here today. The staff are convened to hear your words. Whenever you're ready. You have all been through some difficult times. And the king has been too preoccupied to treat you as he should. But I ask you all to ignore any wild rumors you hear. I promise to speak with my brother about improving conditions for both you and your families outside the castle. Thank you. You call that a royal speech? You didn't shout, you didn't threaten, and you were far too reasonable. <laughs> it was bloody marvelous. Right then, ready for today's training? Take good care of him, Walter. I suppose you've heard the rumors then. Well, I'm afraid they're quite true. Who knows what your brother will do next? In the meantime, the mood in the castle is getting more uneasy by the day. A lot of people to see your brother today. Poor sods. Sir Walter! What a stroke of luck. Would you be so kind as to sign my petition? We must fight to eradicate poverty in Albion. Too many suffer on our streets, and the king does nothing. He must be made to care. Oh, very well, but I'm just an old soldier. I doubt my name would mean anything. But perhaps the prince here would care to help you out. Oh, th that would be wonderful, your majesty. Well, it would be the greatest honor. I have a family to support. If anything happens to me... I'd be happy to sign. Thank you, my good prince. Your support will make all the difference, I'm certain of it. That was a courageous move. I doubt it would make much of a difference, but perhaps your brother will finally realize that you have a mind of your own. Let's see you put it to good use in the combat room. Come on! You have made good progress these past few weeks. Fight! Ouch! Good hit! Do you remember the stories I tell you when you were a child? Of your father, the great hero king. You'd never get tired of hearing those stories. And after each one, do you remember what you would say? Teach me how to be a hero! Every single time. I wish that was something an old soldier like me could teach you. But I've done my best. Now I need you to do your best. Strike me. What are you afraid of? Hit me. <laughs> you only went and broke it. Look at that. Am I a great teacher or what? <laughs> but listen, 
There's something... Walter! You have to come quickly! Both of you! What happened? Outside the castle. It looks like a demonstration. This is not good. They're right inside the castle grounds. I've never seen so many people out there. Balls. I should have known this would happen. I don't think they realize what your brother is capable of. This isn't going to end well. Keep Albion free! We want you! It's been a long time since Logan listened to me, but I should find him. Stay here. There's still something we need to talk about. We can't just stand here. I have a horrible feeling about this. We need to do something. Look, the guards have moved away from the stairs. We should follow Walter, find out what Logan's going to do. Let's go while we can. They must be in the war room. Then let's get... I have been betrayed by my own blood and a filthy spy. We did nothing wrong. Punishment must be apportioned where it belongs. Punish me, then. You are no longer a child, and it is time I stopped treating you as one. You wish to save the traitors who had gathered outside the castle this morning very well. You shall have your chance to save them. Here stand the leaders of the violent mob. I will give you a choice. Who will be punished? These strangers or this girl? The sentence will be death. What? No, this can't be. You are the prince. Decide. Your Majesty, Logan, please. I am giving you power over life and death. No, I won't do this. If you can't choose, I will. They will all be executed. So tell me, what are you willing to sacrifice to do the right thing? This is madness. We can't. We just can't. Choose me. You can't let them all die. Choose me. There's only one decision you can make. It has to be me. Are you listening to me? Pick me. I know this isn't easy, but you... Thank you. Uh, thank you. It's all right. You did what you had to do. Never forget what he's done. And that I love you. Take the girl away. Kill her now. I will never forgive you for this. Good. Then you will never forget it. Escort my brother to his chambers, now. Would have been your own death. Still, maybe I should have taken you away sooner. There is something rather sinister about this garden at night. Where are we going? I, I thought we were leaving the castle. We are, but there's something we must do first. It's time we paid our respects to Albion's last hero. I never thought I'd enter this place again. You should have known better. The night your father died, I promised him I would bring you here one day. When you were old enough and strong enough. This is your history. This is your legacy. The world has been too long without a hero, but I'm hoping that it will have one soon. This is your father's most treasured possession, the Guild Seal. It chooses those who have the power inside them. Those who have the potential to become legends. Still though, <laughs> it bloody works! Somewhat narrow. Dark too. You never did care for confined spaces, did you, Sir I never did care for being poked in the eye or having my head chopped off. What of it? Oh dear, I seem to have struck a nerve. How about if I strike a butler on the bunce? Ah, now this.
this is more like it. Grand, spacious, a plentiful supply of oxygen. Just the way a castle's escape route should be. I hesitate to ask, but what is our plan? Other than leaving the castle far behind us, which I wholly approve of, obviously. It's simple. We have to stop Logan. How am I supposed to do that? E even if I am a hero, I'm just one person. Exactly. That is why we need to find allies. And lots of them. Once you prove what you are, people will follow you. And many of them will be willing to fight. Paths, take them up! Well, young hero, this is your chance to show them what you've got. Jasper, did you see it? Well, I know I am. Come on. And I'm proud of you too, old friend. I've never seen a man cower with such grace. It is merely a matter of hygiene. Bats are filthy creatures. <laughs> anyway, I think we've just seen the first proof of what you can do. You are the hero who can lead this land in a revolution. Bats? Just the beginning. More bats! Get ready to cast some magic down! Another impressive display is to think. This morning, my job consisted of laying out clothes for royalty. Now, I'm a midnight snack for bats. You might want to cover your noses from here on. It's the Bowerstone sewers. Oh, you might want to cover your eyes, too, Jasper. More bats! Time to exterminate a few more bats. certainly got the hang of that spell. 